Video overlay transparency. Hmm, let me see about doing this here because this is kind of a thing. In our advanced PowerPoint templates, here's a trick you'll see all the time. Here's a sample slide. I'll let this preview. Right, so what we'll see is this really interesting kind of geometric oh, filter effect on top of this particular slide, right? And it's kind of neat. I like it. The question is, how do you create this as an overlay effect in PowerPoint? There's a problem. Let me explain what I mean by that. So I'm going to create a new slide. So here's just a blank slide. I'll click on this guy and let's go to the selection pane. So let's hide all and then let's turn our background picture on and what we'll see here is that there oh, there's a video on top. So let's click that and this is the geometric shape video. I'll go ahead and play this. Right. But here's the thing. Here's the video. Here's the picture. And what you'll notice is that you can't see the picture. Why? Because the video is on top of it. So what I'd like to do is what? Add some transparency to this so that it looks like it does in the sample slide. Well, here's the thing. If you click on this, you might be thinking, well, I can go to video format and maybe there's a transparency option. You can look. You can look through all this stuff. You will not find a transparency option like you can with a static image, right? Okay, let's right click. You can go to format video and you can look on all these different options and you will not find a way to make this thing transparent. I promise you. <laughs> so the question is, how do you do that? So let's do it with a demo here. Here's my blank slide. I'm going to right click. I'm going to format background and let's just fill it with a picture. Just because it's quick and easy to do. We'll do it from file and we'll pick an image. Okay, so now I have a, a picture and let's go up here and for simplicity demo purposes I'm just going to click on this thing and I'm going to copy and let's paste. So now I have a video on top of my image and the cool thing about these overlays is you can find hundreds <laughs> of kind of interesting videos like this on sites like Pixels or Pixabay and we'll use them as these overlays because the effect is just so cool, right? So I put a video clip on top here and let's take a look at what we kind of need to do to make this happen. Let's go to the animations and the animation pane and here we want to make sure that we set it to start with previous and also on the playback we want it to start automatically. So those are the two things just to get this to work in our PowerPoint template that probably need to happen. Okay, so let's preview that. And yes, it starts automatically, but again, there's no transparency. Here's how you do that. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to go to the Animations tab, and I'm going to go to Add Animation. And if you scroll down here to Transparency, I'm going to add a Transparency Emphasis effect. So we'll add the Transparency effect, open the Animation pane, and I want this to start with Previous. Don't need this trigger event, so we'll delete that. Our video set with Previous. And set to play automatically. So now, if we go ahead and preview it, 
boom, we have our effect, an overlay effect. That's how you add transparency to an overlay video. It's a little bit of a process, but once you kind of get that down, it's really not too bad. Of course, what we can do then is hit the drop down here, go to Effect Options, and we can play with the amount. The larger the number, the less of the video you will see. So if I want it to be kind of subtle, maybe I change this to 75%. Okay, and then let's close this stuff and let's kick it into slideshow mode. There we go. Fun effect. But if you didn't know how to do that, it would drive you nuts trying to figure out you know, how to make that video transparent. Any questions on that? I like that trick. That's a good one.